Lennox, how you doing? I'm all right, mate. Thank you. Good. Good to see you again. Last yeah, time I see you, just battered Willie Hutchinson. Yeah, man. Yeah, mate. It was a good one, wasn't it? I think, you know, a lot of people had Willie down as favourite and, you know, obviously he was having plenty of chat during the week. Yeah, I don't know why though, mate. And they got that wrong, didn't they? He was used to rolling people over, wasn't he? So uh, I think after he gave me his best shots and I kept on coming, I think I broke his heart. Yeah, I think as well, I could hear Dom sort of saying, telling him to get behind the jab, but he sort of wanted to get involved in a firefight, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, it was the wrong move. Just looking back on your last couple of fights, and you were unlucky. You got the split decision in the fight before. Um, do you think there's any chance of a rematch there? Obviously, we'd like to, but um, I don't think he'd want it. So we'll just keep pushing forward in my career, and uh, if we end up meeting again, I'll, I'll smash him up, for sure. Every boxer's dream is to become a world champion. That's, that's a given, but... I mean, in, in, in the steps you want to take, where, where do you sort of hope to be in a few fights' time? I didn't think I'd be here, mate, to be honest, coming from the white colours, so uh, I'm happy to be here and I'm going to go as far as I can go and just uh, keep pushing on. Yeah, tell us a bit about that. So, that, so that's, your, that's quite an unusual background, isn't mm. it? So explain what was happening. What sort of job were you doing at the time? Yeah, obviously I was working with my dad in the garage and uh, I was walked into a gym one day, got beat up and just kept going back for more and uh, someone sent me to Errol and I, I, I ain't looked back since. So, I mean, just to clarify, there was no amateur background or anything like that? No, no, no amateur. Just uh, six white colour and, uh, and that's it, mate. <laughs> and how, how did you get involved? What, what made you sort of get into that? I mean, we, did you like boxing as a kid? Or? No, it's, uh, it was just a, a off chance. Uh, I got asked to come and do a charity event and I went and done it. Uh, won. And I won my little six and I, like, I just wasn't satisfied beating all them bums up. And then uh, I spoke with, uh, obviously, one of the Errol's pros, Kevin McCauley. And he just said, look, you're too good for that. Uh, I'll take you up to Earls and uh, here I am today. And let's talk about a bit about this, Jim. Um, you, you, you're training here with Errol. You've yeah. got Zach. What do you think of Zach? How do you... Good fighter. Uh, unbelievable talent. And uh, he's a very good lad, yeah. And how far do you think he can go? Well, I think he can go all the way. And uh, I'm not just saying that because he's standing here now, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I believe he can. And what about sparring? You're obviously the same Obviously, he, he can go all the way unless he fights me because I smash. <laughs> Yeah, I've been inspiring that. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't touch me. How's sparring going between you two? Uh, mate, we have, really co we have really competitive spars and, uh, you know, obviously we're the best sparring combination in the gym to have anyway. So, uh, yeah, mate, it's good stuff. Yeah, and is it, do, you, do you sort of go all in on the spar? Yeah, I, smash, I told you I smash him up. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Smash him up, mate. I'm on the ropes. Yeah, I'm I'm not not <laughs> yeah, man. yeah, it's class. It is good. Yeah, we've got a good gym as well. We've got a lot of good fighters down here as well, and uh, all fighting behind there, all in there. Uh, everything's going well for us. We haven't spent a bit of time in now. You can see it's like you know they, what they say is a happy fight is a good fight, and it yeah, does look, it's got a good vibe about yeah, this man. place. Yeah, man. It is. Yeah, um, it's credit to be down here at the moment, and. Uh, Obviously, me and Zach leading it, as well, obviously, as well as Tyler and all that, doing well, Liam Davis, it's a good stable to be around.